Hello everyone and welcome. This is Selic, and I am playing Feed the Beast. I just loaded up a new world here. Alright, found some oil right off the bat. That's awesome. Guys, I'm excited about playing Feed the Beast. I've been playing Minecraft for about a year now. Um, and really, really enjoy the technical aspects of Minecraft, building, uh, redstone, uh, the engineering, um, and I thought, you know, Feed the Beast would be a fun uh, new project to try. I have um, been trying to learn a little bit about the mods. I'm excited about, you know, build craft, industrial craft, um, what is it, the forestry, even the thom craft, the magical uh, aspect of, of the mod pack, really, really cool. And uh, also really dig these new biomes. These are really beautiful, I mean, as far as a video game can be, uh, as far as Minecraft can be. Um, oh, there was zombie. And uh, so yeah, I'm really excited about playing the game. And um, you know, one of my favorite parts about Minecraft is that you can start off with absolutely nothing, and punch some wood. Try punching this wood. And with a few punches, you can go from a block of wood to some pretty epic things, some pretty cool structures, designs, and, uh, and of course the survival aspect of Minecraft is cool as well. And with that in mind, I, I wanted to challenge myself in this game. I wanted to challenge myself to going into one of the more forbidding biomes. And so this glacier biome I think is actually pretty cool. Now, granted, it's a pretty desolate place. There's not much to it. There's a lot of, a lot of snow and ice and some rock. But I think that much more, it makes it that much more challenging to build something here. Uh, and make it pretty cool. And um, so that's that's going to be my challenge. Of course, I need a lot of things to gather. Nothing grows. Nothing at all grows in, um, in those biomes. So uh, I'm going to have to be doing a lot of resource gathering initially. Uh, obviously, we need to find ourselves a place to stay for the night. And i um, thinking maybe we're over here somewhere in the woods. But let me uh, punch, some more, punch some more wood here. And... See, I'm I'm excited about getting um, getting things started and exploring around, checking out this new world. I I was doing some seed exploring, saw the glacier, and figured, hey, that's gonna be that's needs to be what I need to um, build in. So, um, part of the part of the cool thing I think about the Feed the Beast uh, mod pack is that you have so many new um, different types of blocks. Ooh, what is that? Corn kernel. What in the world is this thing shedding? What's going on here? Uh, yeah, so new new block types, new um, new ways of, of you know powering your your world. Um, I'm really interested in. I don't know why I'm picking all these up. Uh, I'm really interested in the. Um, whoa, sheep. That means, that means I can sleep in a bed for my very first night. That's pretty unbelievable. I don't think I've ever played Minecraft, uh, started a new world, and spawned next to sheep. That is great. All right, let's build us something here. So what was I saying? I lost track. I'm sure it's something I was excited about. Oh, the block types. That's right. Uh, block types and different mechanics in the game. Uh, I think that the... Um, um, the powering system is pretty cool. I'm really interested in looking into doing biofuel. I pay attention to what I'm doing here. I need a sword. Um, I think that the the biofuel system looks pretty cool uh, from the forestry mod. I'll uh, see. I'll need that. And I'll go ahead and get an axe. Ah, we can wait. We can get some stone tools, and that will be a lot better. Okay, sheep. One. Ooh. Nice little hidey hole, too. One, two, and three. All right. Let's get set up down here. 
uh, yeah, so I'm, 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 I'm pretty thrilled about all the new blocks, the new textures, not textures, but new uh, mechanics of the game. What's that? Interesting. And um, definitely need some coal. Uh, so being able to build something pretty epic, I think, is going to be a pretty exciting task. Um, one of my goals is to make something, you know, obviously everyone wants to make some sort of epic structure, um, but I also want it to be a little fun, um, maybe a little whimsical. Um, and I'm going to challenge myself to not be symmetric. It's hard when everything in, in Minecraft is, you know, in block form. And so it's an extra challenge for me. I think a lot of people who play Minecraft are a little OCD. At least I know I am. And so I like everything to be perfect and symmetric. And I want to try to get away from that if I can. Um, so another challenge uh, of building in a glacier biome will be to also um, keep things maybe a little unusual. Um, so my goal, other than obviously everyone, uh, I mean, everyone's goal is to build a structure. Um, so other than that, my first few days, uh, I want to be looking to get a farm up, you know, going as quickly as possible. And how are we doing on daylight? Is that a sun or a cloud? I can't tell. It looks like a cloud. I don't know that I can mine that with a wooden pick. So let's go throw this guy in the pond I saw over here. There we go. And we will build ourselves a new cobble pick. There it is. So yeah, I want to be looking into the, the biofuel. I want to be looking into... Um, I want to get one of those jetpacks. I don't know if you've seen those. They're pretty... Wait, what am I doing? Pretty cool. Um, and, yeah, so... Jetpacks and cool nano suits, whatever I can get my hands on, try all those things out. Uh, as far as my mining goes, I'll well, see. Let's put this here. Um, you know, I'm interested in using the quarry. I'm interested in using... Um, the, I believe it's called a filler, uh, which seems to be pretty efficient as far as um, clearing out space goes. So that, I think that's going to be pretty cool. And um, focus. All right, I'm probably going to need some food here shortly as well. Uh, okay, let's get rid. Wait, no, we don't want to get rid of that. We want to build something. A bed. I hear a monster nearby. I believe that's going to cause us problems when we want to sleep. Alright, let's see. My wooden sword. Ooh, let's build some torches. Right, this. Ah! Not, not good, not good, not good. <laughs> Angry zombie, I hate these things. Wow. Whew. <laughs> you need to be careful where I go jumping in. Oh, very nice. Nice cave system here. Let's put some lights in. I'm just going to seal this bad boy off for now. And that hurt. I need to get some food quick. If I can find a pig or a cow out here. Oh, that's sunsetting. But hey, I can turn turn it right into day. Ooh, a new version of the portal gun available. That and that's another cool thing. The the portal gun you have the ability to um, it's just like the game portal, where um, you can shoot w like an, a blue portal hole in a wall and a yellow or an orange portal hole in a wall somewhere, and uh, you can actually I got some zombie meat. And then you can travel. And I don't think there's any distance limitations with it either. So I think that seems pretty cool. Um, let's explore around. Oh, I got some pumpkins there. That's cool. All these new plant types, these mushrooms, I don't know 
don't know much about the mushrooms if they're edible. Uh, I think that's oily sand. I think you can you can refine that, I believe. Let's grab some pumpkins. Oh wait, I think I have to have an axe for that. Now that they made the changes where um, you have to actually use the tool that you think you'd have to use. Is that more oil? It is. Probably shouldn't go swimming in it. Um, yeah, so we need to make sure we can harvest those pumpkins. Come on, where's an animal? I need a pig or a something. I guess I should, prob should probably punch some of these guys here to start a... Oh, oh, this is a volcano. I know what that is. And this is, uh, speaking of block types, this is one of my favorite new block types. Uh, uh, what's it called? Bo it's not bauxite. Ooh, a wolf. Anyways, the new block type, whatever it's called, uh, is really cool because it has a, you can make, um, you know, there's a cobble version of it when you first mine it. There's a, um, there's when you can cook it and make it smooth again, or you can, um, sapling. <coughs> you can uh, turn it into bricks. Uh, I wish they had stairs and slabs, but they don't have that quite yet. Um, maybe they'll add that uh, eventually, but I love the color. And so I'm definitely excited about using that and uh, building ooh, another oil oil spout. <gasps> a village? Yes. <laughs> I thought I saw some wheat. Uh-oh. Poor guys. Their village has a water, or water, a oil thing. Messing up your crops. Is it abandoned? Where's everyone? There they are. Now I can have bread. This is awesome. Not only have I never spawned next to sheep, I've never spawned next to a village. Or this close to a village, anyways. This is a big village. Wow. Hello. You're an apple trader. Do not want any apples from you. I don't know what, who all these guys are. I mean, what their roles are. What are you? No. Oh. A book dealer, eh? All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and get some more of my supplies together, I guess. Did I plant that? Anyways, um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get some supplies together, and I probably should just go ahead and move my bed over here, and uh, that way I can, uh, this will be a nice starting area to get some potatoes, some wheat, some bread, um, and do some more exploring. So I'm going to do that, and then um, I will uh, be back. All right. I have gathered my things and I am heading back to the village. I was able to make some bread and get my hunger bar uh, up and the sun is setting quickly. And I decided I'd look up look up real quick what this is. This is I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Basalt or yeah, I'm going to assume it's basalt. And um which um really reminds me of bath salt. Don't know why, well, I know why, because it sort of sounds like it, but um, there will be no bath salts here. Well, yeah, not for me anyways. Uh, speaking of bath salts, I've had some pretty um, bad experiences with my first, the first time I ever went to a village. Um, I believe it was the zom zombie apocalypse. Zombies from all over the place came out and destroyed my village. Very depressing. I was trying to get everyone blocked up. I was trying to, to kill all the zombies. And I was trying to be the hero of the village. And I <laughs> failed horribly. Horribly. Um, very sad. I'm gonna, I don't, 
don't know if I planted you or not, but I'm going to take it. And I'm going to set up shop right in here. Oh. Ooh -hoo. Oh. Nice. <laughs> All right, I've got helmet and a new pick and rubber tree saplings. Excellent. Let's get everything down here and sleep before the zombies come. So as I was exploring around and getting ready to go, I figured out where all of the villagers went and why the place looked abandoned. They have all fallen down here and they're having some sort of underground party, it looks like. <laughs> Hello. Let's get this place lit up. And so yeah, I came down here and put some blocks and trying to protect these guys. If I can, we'll see how well we can do. All right. Is this? Oh, I got some iron. Let's go ahead and block this guy off here. Will that do it? It probably won't. Just in case. All right, that should be all right. Let's light this place up and see if we can protect our villagers from harm. And I need to get back and sleep too. All right. Go away. All right. Well, I'm gonna work on getting these guys out and then we can probably make our preparations to go explore a little bit. All right, I'll be right back. So, are you going to help your friend out? He looks stuck. Go ahead. Give him a hand. You're of no help. All right, buddy. Let's get you out of here. Come on out. Don't just stand there. Maybe he likes it there. Here we are. Our grass is going down here. Uh oh, bad news. Uh oh, another bad news. There we go. I'm surprised he could spawn down here. Is there any coal I was not paying any attention as I came down? Nope. There's some green stuff. What is that? Monazit? 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 I have no idea. But we shall get it. Oh, get out of my way, buddy. I'm trying to work here. Here's some coal. Good. And a crystal. We still have guys down here. Really? You can just walk up right here. No? Oh, you can't. Well, you can walk up right here. Is it too complicated for you, buddy? Do you have a small brain? Anyways. Cool is what we need. Yes. Definitely need coal. So, I want to go exploring just a little bit, but we're about ready to call it an end for the day. As a matter of fact... I think, yeah, we uh, have done, I mean, I need to do a lot more off camera. Um, just want to look and see what kind of cave system we have here. Oh, nice cave system with lots of mobs. Oh, that's an angry zombie. Angry zombies are angry. Oh, and he sees me already. <laughs> Hell no. Oh, I can't do that either. Gotta put a block down. There we go. Alright, creeper, stay away. Yep, so I'm gonna uh, call it an end for today. I'm going to uh, get this coal, uh, start exploring a little bit, get some more resources going, and uh, next episode. We will probably start scouting out a place over back on the glacier, uh, scouting out a place 
that we would want to set up our permanent home so we can start our uh, branch mining. Um, I don't know that I mentioned this earlier, but I'm I'm going to try to use. Um, I don't think I can get that with a stone axe. Um, my stone pick. I'm going to uh, start off using mining turtles just a little bit, and then uh, work our way into um, getting uh, either a quarry or uh, the filler going. And um, I'll and I probably will do that at a different look. Really, a different location than um, than our where we're going to be setting up our base. Because I'd like to sort of preserve the area. I'm not going to open up a big old hole uh, and start. Um, and start building. I'm going to probably use a lot of the landscape and the, the caverns beneath to uh, to build our uh, to start our build uh, with the our permanent home, the the epic fortress that we will uh, rule the world. I'm sure. <laughs> with so, anyways, guys, I really appreciate you watching. Um, leave a comment. Uh, certainly would enjoy some discussion. And um, yeah. And uh, leave a uh, give a like if you enjoy the video, um, and I will uh, see you guys again next time. Uh oh, I have angered an Enderman. Oh, I'm a creeper. Whoa, time! Oh wow! <laughs> oh no! I thought for sure I was dead. I might just die right here. Uh. <laughs>